I had some amazing news this week. Um, I received an email from the European Parliament in the UK to say that my project touring the EU27 last year, uh, titled The Future is Europe, has received the UK Charlemagne Youth Prize for this year. Um, I wanted to take this opportunity to say thank you to the European Cultural Foundation, who awarded me with a Democracy Needs Imagination grant, and also to all my crowdfunders who supported the project and helped make it possible. Basically what I did was I travelled around the EU27 uh, where I was speaking at events, performing protest songs and uh, interviewing fellow activists from across the EU to find out what actions they're taking to stand up for Europe and why they think it's important to fight for closer integration for the future. This footage I edited into a documentary which is titled The Future is Europe and it's available on my YouTube. Um, during the tour, I also created artworks uh, which document the cultural diversity and the beauty of our great shared continent and celebrate the way in which the EU facilitates our access to these wonderful places um, and provides opportunities to live, work, study and travel across the member states. These artworks I turned into my book, The Future is Europe, which has been received into the collections at the House of European History in Brussels. Um, another outcome from my project was my music video and song Always on the Road, which went viral on Twitter and was featured on Sky News. I have to say a huge thanks to Jeff Q for coming over to Brussels to film it with me. He edited it and he supported the project on so many levels. I really couldn't have done it without his support. Or my dad, who has helped with a lot of the organisational stuff. So thank you to both of you. Um, a final, more reflective outcome was my abstract oil painting titled European Integration. So that's what I've been up to. Um, I'm really looking forward to the award ceremony in Aachen uh, later this year with the other EU27 national winners to find out more about their projects. And uh, thank you to everyone who contributed to the project online. Um, I'm so proud to have received this award.